intersectionality is really the interplay of identities, right? Overlapping identities that within the individual and how those identities then affect their health outcomes, right? So for example, um, you know, poverty, um, being black, uh, being queer, those three things, um, have being unstably housed, that's a fourth dimension. Um, having, you know, issues of uh, mental health issues or a disability, that could be a fifth dimension. I mean, all of these things would basically, and they've been shown to, that these individuals have poor outcomes when it comes to their health, um, primarily based on some of the issues that I mentioned in terms of um, difficulty accessing care, racism and discrimination within healthcare, the um, differences in what's offered to them in terms of treatment, Options and and also what insurances will pay for, which is largely determines um, you know the types of treatments and the types of medications that people are offered, um, and oftentimes that's very inequitable. You know when you compare across you know public versus private insurances, so you know that that intersectionality you know really does dramatically affect one's health. Um, if, for example, if you look at the case of, um, you know, HIV, now we're seeing that the one of the highest, um, you know, populations that are most becoming most affected uh, with the HIV infection are um, are queer individuals, right? Um, and also, black women are behind that, uh, shortly, behind, you know, closely behind that. Um, and you know, it's even estimated that as many as 50 percent of you know transgender women have HIV as well. So when you kind of look at these, when you start to kind of unpack, um, you know, these specific demographic identities um, and how they correlate so closely with health outcomes, you really see that we do ha kind of have to start to, uh, you know, unpack how and why these things occur. What are the conditions such that um, they put people in a vulnerable situations such, such that they um, then become susceptible to diseases like HIV, for example.